So last year, I set myself a goal for 2023. The plan for me is to see if I can do a tech video every single day from January until March. It's time to get that ball rolling. Absolutely crushing it. One of the things that I most often get wrong when I'm trying to do a select statement, any select statement, is I misspell from as form. And of course, with Oracle, generally, if you're just doing a one row select, any kind of expression or consonant, etc., we have to do select from dual. It's the most common typo I make. In 23C, that is now a thing of the past. Wherever I used to have from dual, I can simply omit that. So I can have select sysdate and the job is done. And all the other places I would normally use from dual also apply. So I can do select a constant. I can do select a sequence not next val whenever I want to get a sequence value. Obviously no, not that I would normally do that. I can normally do that just in, directly in my insert statements, etc. You probably shouldn't ever have to do sequence not next val from dual anyway. But if you do, you no longer need the from dual. I can do expressions as well. I can do a select expression. The common tool we use to use from dual to generate sequences of numbers, that also works as well. We just throw in our normal connect by without the from dual, and that will spit out the numbers that we require. And similarly, PL SQL functions can now just be selected with a select statement. If the PL SQL function does not take any parameters, you'll still need the opening and closing brackets to let the database know that it is indeed a function. Now, before you start to panic, yes, from dual still works fine. It's not like you have to race out and change any occurrences you currently had of from dual. That still works fine. And in fact, if we throw on an auto trace onto a select without the from dual and do an explain plan to see what's going on under the covers, you can see that what we've really done here is a little bit of syntactic sugar, a convenience for developers. What we now do is whenever you do select, for example, sysdate, if we do an execution plan, you'll see it actually is select sysdate from dual under the covers. What we've really done is kept the same functionality, but saved you from typing those extra keystrokes. So select from dual will still work just fine. Select without from dual will also work just fine. And whatever you do, don't think that I'll go ahead and try drop the dual table. That would be a disaster on any database running any version, even 23C. Dual stays there. You just don't have to reference it anymore with any of your new code. Coming in 23C, no more from Jewel.